What is going on, everybody? This is your boy Sean, aka Stay Puff 1983, and I am here with a haul video, the second part of my Infinity Toy and Comic Con haul. This is the AOK -OK portion, the Act of Kindness. I've gotten books from Jeff Cantonese Comic Kid, and I've gotten books from Steve, Steve White, and Stone Cold. So I'm going to start off with Jeff's books, and I'm going to start off with a book that I was missing on the four issue miniseries, and he hooked me up with it and got me issue two of Wolverine. This completes the miniseries. I have all four issues. Happy for that. Sent me Carla Cohan Vampirella Virgin Variant, issue number 10. Beautiful cover here. Mike Foam, Red Sonja, Agent, Age of Chaos, issue number one. Absolutely beautiful. And then he sent me a couple of vampies. I have this one, but it's not bad to have a second copy. It's Vampirella 16 from the Warren run. And Vampy issue 56. Those are the books that Jeff hooked me up with. Go check out his channel, Cantonese Comic Kid. You know, he does live videos every Wednesday and Sunday. Wednesday, he does his Cantonese comic haul. We talked about his haul comics. And he translates words into Cantonese. And he also does a live stream on Sunday called Extreme Nerd Table. Every Sunday, 9 p.m. And he also a part of the Silver Age Sunday crew. So most of the times he'd be on that show. And he'll pop in on my Saturday show. So definitely look up the Cantonese Comic Kid on YouTube and Instagram. And give him a follow. Now Stone Cold stunned me at the show this amazing slab first appearance or some say his first full appearance because since her first appearance was in issue 23 they considered a cameo even though she had a couple of camp uh, a couple of appearances in the pages but CGC says this is the first full appearance but it's as the first cover appearance of Red Sonia Conan the Barbarian issue number 24 it's a 7 point Signed by Roy Thomas. Stone Cold Steve stunned me with this. You know, when I said I was actively looking for this issue, I was I was settled for a raw copy, but the fact that he hooked me up with this as an A-OK, -okay, Steve is just a phenomenal guy. Y'all seen us on my show. Y'all seen from the videos that, and, and check out the video I just dropped on my YouTube page. You know, detailing the whole time at the Infinity Toy and Comic Call because it was a great time. I got to meet comics with Beulah. I've said this on previous haul video, but got to meet comics with Beulah and we just hung out through the whole show. Phenomenal show. It was a small show, it wasn't too crowded, but Steve hooked me up with this and I'm very thankful. You know, I, I gave him some books to go home with, but man, Steve. He really went out of his way to, to, to get this book for me. You know, it's just an awesome guy. You know, Stone Cold Steve Whiting. Thank you so much for, for a -OK in this to me. You didn't have to do it, but you went out of your way because of the generosity in your heart and that you just love doing this for people in the community. And that's what makes you such a great guy. So shout out to Stone Cold Steve. Awesome book. He also had another stack of books for me. Some great ones and especially a huge stack of Superman books. Well, I'm going to start with these. We got Black Panther issue number 29 signed by Bob Allman. I know he did some artwork on this series. I have another one issue 35 signed by Allman. 
Love the defenders in the background. Awesome cover. Black Panther issue number six. Coat front. Black Rise of the Black Panther issue number four. Black Panther cosplay cover issue number seven. Then you have Black Panther issue number seven, another variant. Covered by Bill Sinkovich. These are the hip hop variants. He hooked me up with a couple of hip hop variants. I have Secret Wars issue number one. Some of them I'm familiar with, and some of the hip hop bands could be like more newer albums. But this is this Doctor Strange annual, which looks dope. Deadpool and the Brooks for Money, number one. Doctor Strange and the Source of Supreme. Spider-Man 2099, issue number one. Got a tribe called Quest here with Rocket number one. Star Lord number one. Unworthy Thor number one. Avengers number one. Got cable number one. Civil War two number one. I don't like Civil War two at all. Beat down cover. And last but not least, unbelievable wind pool. Steve hooked me up with, with those hip hop variants. And then he hooked me up with all these Superman families. I'm gonna solve them. my favorite one, Superman Family issue 185. Neil Adams cover, Jimmy Olsen drop kicking Superman. That's pretty funny. This one is a bit damaged. It's uh, Superman Family 190. See the damage on the top. They looked at, they presented well when I showed them on the Comic Call show. But then when I started looking at them, I'm like, yeah, I can see some damage somewhere on there. Superman Family 192. Superman Family 193. Superman Family 194 with a miniature Justice League fighting Superman. There's Superboy on Superman Family number 196. Superman Family 197. Family 198. This is a Supergirl cover. It's got multiple characters on there. That's five complete stories. 
think I have like maybe one issue of Batman Family around the same time. But it's Superman Family 186 going to the 80s. Superman Family 187. Got Superman Family 209. This feel, this book feels thinner than the others. Superman Family 1210. Superman Family 213 Superman Family 214 Lex Luthor have Supergirl on the trap Superman Family 215 with another Supergirl saying she's Supergirl and she's taking over. And you have 216, more Supergirl. Now it's down to four stories, not five stories, in issue 217, starring the Golden Age. Is man get his ass booked on the cover? And this is a cover by Rick Buecher and Gor Giordani. Superman family back to Supergirl with issue 218. Superman family 219. Then issue 220. Last but not least, 208. You could say this was a super AOK -okay phone call Steve. So that is it for my Infinity Toy and Comic Haul. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, share, anything. You know, we do videos at least every weekend, or at least we're trying to do live streams every weekend. You know, we have a 
Comic Con Roundtable live stream coming this coming Saturday. It's going to be a Christmas theme episode. And uh, you'll probably see some haul videos throughout the week, mine's included. And uh, please subscribe to the channel. You know, just brothers that love to talk comics and you know, all the news that dropped last week we discussed on yesterday's live stream. So make sure you checked out the previous live stream and uh, subscribe to my page, Stay Puff 1983. I do live streams every Saturday and I'll occasionally pop on through the comic book community live streams. And yeah, go sub up Stone Cold Steve Whiting on uh, YouTube. He ain't got no videos, but we trying to get him to a thousand subs with no videos. So Steve Whiting on YouTube, sub him up, man. Awesome guy. And uh, that is it for my haul. Peace out, y'all. Enjoy your week and uh, read some comics. Later, y'all.